Welcome to this tech tip on commissioning the Sunny Tri Power X US-50. Before we begin, ensure you have successfully connected the AC and DC cables to the inverter and have linked each inverter with a Cat5 cable. We recommend commissioning the inverters in the system prior to connecting to the local area network. After commissioning is complete, connect to the on-site network to get connection to the internet. To access the commissioning page, do one of the two methods. Plug an Ethernet cable from the STPX into your computer, open a web browser, and enter this IP address, https colon forward slash forward slash 169.254.12.3. In the safety page, click advance, and then click continue to be taken to the commissioning page. Alternatively, you can locate the inverter soft access Wi-Fi signal by searching for the serial number of the inverter. Find the WPA2 PSK password on the sticker on the side of the inverter or in the quick reference guide that is included in the box. Once connected to the inverter's Wi-Fi, enter HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash 192.168.12.3. This is the starting page to commission the system. On the starting page, click continue and enter the required fields. Please record your username and password for future reference. Each STPX can either be a system manager or a subordinate device. For non-controlling devices, you can select lower level inverter to commission those devices. If configured as a system manager, it can detect up to five additional devices that are on the same network. This can be a combination of inverters, energy meters, or weather stations. Let's commission the system as a system manager. Please properly name your device to be able to identify your inverter later. Check mark each of these for proper updates and synchronization with Sunny Portal. In this step, you can detect Modbus devices such as energy meters or weather stations. Click the SMA speed wire devices section to add PV inverters to the plant. Enter a system password that meets the criteria and then click search devices. All SMA devices connected to the system manager will populate. Check the box for the device you'd like to add to the system and then click continue. Remember, the total number of devices is five max plus the system manager. Select the country data set from the drop-down menu. Refer to your utility requirements to select the right country data set. The system operating parameters will be configured in all inverters. If an energy meter is included in the system, you can configure the meter to be the point of interconnection reference. This is often used in zero export systems. This meter reference displays building loads and PV export graphs in the portal. If you have a SCADA system that collects PV Modbus data on site, check this box to enable Modbus. Otherwise, click continue. Based on your country data set, all settings should automatically be configured correctly. No additional steps are needed on this page unless you have unique system requirements. Click save to complete the commissioning process. After commissioning and connecting the system to the internet, you can register your plant for free in NXOS Sunny Portal. The system manager's PIC RID will be used to register the plant. Your system manager can now collect data from your other inverters and display performance in NXOS Sunny Portal. If there's any issues with your plant, the portal can be configured to send alerts. We highly recommend activating Smart Connected for free monitoring by SMA. For more information on the Sunny Tri Power X, visit our product page by scanning this QR code or visit our website at sma-america.com.